is going on everybody static here bringing you another new world video and in today's video we're going to be looking at an efficient way to bring your furnishing from level one up to level 75 so let's get into it so one of the reasons why i think this is super efficient is that it only takes two resources the first one being fibers we need a lot of fibers so we obviously need to get some linen so what i'm going to do i'm going to make a crap ton of linen but however i need to keep some of the fibers by itself so out of this 2,367, uh, I might put it up to, say, 2,000, okay? And I'm going to craft this 2,000. And that is going to give me, ooh, nice big bonus. Nice, nice, nice. 73,000 experience. Wicked. Okay, so now we have that. So like I said, technically it actually only takes two materials. It's going to take linen and it takes fibers and it takes one other material, but technically you only need to collect hemp for this. And if you guys are struggling to find fibers, aka hemp, I did put a guide out yesterday where I have an amazing fiber route that I go around. Um, it's pretty simple. It's pretty straightforward. It's pretty effective and you can gain quite a lot of fiber by doing it. So I'll leave that linked in the, uh, in the comment section down below if you do want to check that out. So the second material that we're going to need is crossweave. Now crossweave, the only way you can farm it is by going to each of the villages and checking out chests and searching chests and farming chests that kind of way otherwise you can get it in the market now the good thing about this is that crossweave is one of the exp or one of the cheaper ones i say um so you can pick it up rather cheaply compared to weak solvent or sand flux so at the moment there it's going for quite a bit more in around 68 cents when i was picking up quite a lot of this i was picking it up in between 30 and roughly about 55 cents so i very quickly just went to another town just to see how much they're going for so there seems to be going for roughly the same what am i going to do i'm just going to pick these up anyways because i want to get this done by today i want to get to level 75 so i'm just going to pick up the cheapest ones i can get at the moment so now that we got all the materials that we need we got our linen we got our fibers and we've got our cross we can go into the workshop and craft our item now just to let you guys know this grind from 1 to 50 was super easy it, it flew in it was absolutely fine from 50 now to uh, 75 hopefully i'll get 75 in this go it took a little bit of extra grinding um but i still think it was super efficient the thing about furniture is that a lot of the times you're not going to have um all the stuff open here you have to go out into the world and find recipes in order to get some of the good, good uh, stuff to craft. Whereas this one, I think everybody should have it. I had it straight away and you started from level zero, like I said, and it's super efficient in terms of um, giving you products that you need back. So I'll show you this in a second. But the item that we're going to be crafting is going to be the round sunny rug. And we can see there, so it takes linen, crossweave and fiber. So it does take 15 linen. So that's what takes up the most of it. That's why you need to collect a lot, a lot of fibers. Um, but apart from that, like it only takes these, it only takes pretty much fibers and cross waves, so two um, resources. Other stuff you can do is like the um, the shelves seem to be pretty handy, which people go off by. But then that still uses iron, and I want to save my iron and I want to save my ash because ash actually. Um, ash uses weak solvent and the whole goal for me to get into the level 75 is i want to actually be able to create trophies in order to sell on in the market and hopefully get into that area which i need um steel so i need iron and i need maple stain which i need weak solvent so this is why i went with this route going for crossweave and fibers crossweave seems to be very common no one it seems pretty underrated out of the whole solvents kind of base and fibers like i said hemp is super easy to get which um like i said I'll leave the comment in the section below if you want to find a good route to do it. So we can make 153 right now. We're at level 70. Let's see what we get to. And boom, there we go. So we actually got to level 78. So we went past it quite a bit, which is fine. I'm happy with that. Now, I do want to show you this as well, guys. So like I said, this is why, one of the reasons why I do like this. We can see here that I have absolutely zero linen left. I have one, one linen left, right? However, if we go into salvage these, um, so we're going to salvage. This gives you a chance of getting one to six linen back for each of these, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to salvage all these and at the very end, and then I'm going to show you how much linen we actually got back from salvaging these. All right, so we're down to the last one. I'm just going to salvage this last one right here. And we can see we are back up to 609 linen. So we started off at one before we salvaged them all, salvaged them all, and we got 608 from doing that. That means if I was low level or if I didn't reach level 75, I could go back in and I could possibly make another 
40 of them, which would give me tons more XP. So this is why I find it very efficient and very good way of leveling up. You're kind of, the more you're doing, the more you're getting back. And it took me, I would say approximately to get to now level 78, I'd say I grinded up about under 20,000 fibers and crossweave I'd say it was in around about maybe 1700 um, and that was it to get to level 78 where I'm at now um, and yeah so now what I'm going to do now that I'm 75 is that I'm going to start getting into trophies um, and yeah I'll go down that road I want to see where that takes me it could be a good possible money gain in the future um, I think they're very slept on at the moment but anyways that is my furnishing guide at the moment um, if you guys did like the video please like and subscribe I greatly appreciate it let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below as well and we'll catch you on the next one bye guys